Hey there, so I'm having a coffee. At Kursostoppen, Nordre Kursostoppen in Berum, Oslo. This is how it looks like. This is in the middle of nowhere, even though you see their houses here, around here, it's only forest, mountain, stuff like that. And I'm going to show you the way back because I already got here. I filmed everything, so on uh, YouTube, on the channel, there is, yeah. The whole road filmed step by step, first till uh, Sundre Kursos Topman, the southern top of Kursos, and this is uh, Nordre Kursos Topman. Uh, I'm uh, having my coffee and then I'll continue going back home. So, first things first, I finish my coffee. This is actually the view from. Kursu Stoppen, Nordre Kursu Stoppen. There is the sunset, and this is a nature reservation. And authorities are asking people to not start any fire, but it looks like someone here did. I saw there is a trail around there. Probably people can walk everywhere. This is pretty safe area. No wild animals to attack. A lot of people around most of the time. Oh, and because uh, this was the main point for this trip, I can enjoy some chocolate now. It even smells so good. Yeah, a lot of energy used for this. I just had my coffee. I feel quite good now after the coffee. And I'm going to take this. I drank uh, some water. All good. Let's see, it's... Uh, 54 minutes walk till civilization so most of the walk is through the forest as you can see here it's nice that on the trees I get to see this telling me where I am where to go Norton Kulso stop the place where I'm coming from and I will continue, uh, I think, towards this way. Stetian, uh, I think that way. Yep, and this is probably the hardest place to pass on. This goes down and it's icy around there. I'm only thinking if I can just jump around here. Uh, I took this this road before so when I came here so this is part of the road <laughs> that I'm doing backwards now you can see there the ice it's uh, I'm just thinking of jumping into the snow here <laughs> feels safer at least in my head when I came here I just bring this I took over that big one I used it to get around here. Okay. Hmm. Looks like people have been going this way. Ah, uh, it's so icy. Okay. Did it. Okay, did it. Look how it is from the from down here. Let's continue. It goes down. Look at this path, so the trees kind of created a crown here and you have to walk down yes. So the only thing that helps me go faster through these paths is that I have these spikes 
his brother that are getting inside the snow and the ice and help me go. This part is actually not really hard to go because it's just snow. But uh, I encountered a lot of ice. Impossible to walk just by having uh, winter shoes. So this is it. I am at this point right now, this fluffy snow here, it's actually a lake, it's called Setetiernat and uh, yeah, I'm uh, scared of going in, seems like some people have been going in, it looks uh, frozen, not sure, it's another midpoint towards a lot of places. I'm going that way so I can get to Yetum where I can find the metro. I have nothing to say about the current location at the moment just about the light because it's 3.35 and at this uh, exact moment in time two weeks ago it was fully dark so the days are getting longer and longer by day that's interesting continuing my path here is the sign that I'm on the right way I managed to get to this point, which is Colso Stopel Natur Reservat, which is actually the whole area around here. And they say there are some birds that are protected around here. And I can actually hear some uh, burbs around. Maybe if I just shut up. No, nothing after I started talking. Well, let's continue the road till the natural reservation close to this point it will be uh, quite a hard way down i remember i had that as a really hard point in the autumn i forgot to tell you something so when i got on the top cursos it was on a different path not this one so that's why I'm still wondering about the uh, directions so after the lakes that you're not it's uh, everything let's say new for today I've been here in autumn and uh, that was it and this is the the way I knew is going downhill really hard let's hope it it's fine in winter time it's quite hard in autumn where it's uh, everything is wet. Let's see now. Look at this. So this is horizontal. This is horizontal, and this is how this goes. It's uh, 70 degrees or something. It's quite hard. It's good I have this. So this is horizontal. And this is how I have to go. It's it's something. <laughs> Can tell you this. It's not that hard anyway. It doesn't feel so hard and dangerous. Still. Well, well. Uh, <laughs> it's adventurous. I can tell you this. I think soon I'm going to finish the hard part look on top I'm coming from there it's something Oop. yeah which way to go now there is no path around me no trail I think I should get down there here or here it looks like more people try this way, but for me this one looks safer. 
I don't know, the snow is quite deep! <laughs> exactly. That was how deep is the snow. Got me scared for a second. Okay, so I managed to do it. So, yeah, it was a lot going down. This is... Hoppa! 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 <laughs> okay, everything is fine. According to the map, the road should be somewhere to the left now. Okay, I see a blue sign there, but there is a blue sign there as well. I think last summer, last uh, autumn, I came here from that way. But if the map says this way, let's just trust uh, the application. Go for it. Hey! A lot of snow, but I'm just passing towards this river. It's quite not river, just a stream of water, fresh water. It feels good. It smells like uh, spring. And another one there. It smells like life getting back. Oh, that's beautiful. And now I'm forced to walk through the river, at least for a bit. I think I can go this way to get along the riverside. It's not so nice, even with uh, great shoes, you might get some water inside. I probably don't have the greatest shoes anyway. And it's nice that right there I can see the sun down is the first time today. Uh, which is not a happy moment for me. I wanted to see the whole trip, but I couldn't. And right now before the sunset it appears and I'm not seeing it, I'm not there. Yeah, let's uh, continue. Okay, I have no idea where I am at the moment. Never seen this, it says it's forbidden to go inside. I have no idea what the hell this is. Even though I've been on this road, it got me to this point where I've never been before, but it looks like a good walking road though. So I'm going to enjoy it. It's nice. Uh, yeah, it says I should go forward. Let's go forward. Who am I to judge? Trusting the apps till the end. Okay, we got to the sunset, at least part of it. And this is like this. And I'm getting to the first point of civilization at the moment. So I have to walk for probably 10 to 15 more minutes until Tebane, the metro station. But uh, this should be easier. I'm tired already, I'm so tired. Getting home, enjoying a shower. But uh, let's continue till the Tebane, I'll show you around. That light we can see there is the sunset. Oh, ho, ho, and I miss that, and we miss that. And it came just now. This is bad. Maybe I can uh, get soon enough out of the forest so we can see it properly. It's quite nice here in January how the sunset goes down. The sun creates yeah. sunset though. I just checked on the map and the uh, Yetum, the station I thought I'm going to, is 25 minutes away from here. But then I just double check it. I'm showing you the sunset while I'm talking. I double check that and there is a closer Tebane, which is how good I think it's spelled. I'm going to that one, it's uh, 10 minutes away. That's better. I don't like that people are allowed to park like this and they are actually allowed. It's not like they are doing this on purpose uh, against the law. I got to the metro station, the Tebane, right here. Oh dear. Okay. 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 
Here it is. I should go on the back of the train, but I'll just stay here. That was everything.